Hey everybody, Phil Crew here. Welcome to Comedy Cigars and Music. And today I'm going to be sharing with you the results I got from an experiment I did with the Bovida and Integra Boost humidity packs. <sighs> Sounds kind of kinky. It's not. Also, experiment might be too scientific of a word. Anyway. I will let you guys know that I'm not associated not sponsored by Bovida or Integra Boost. I've got no affiliation with them whatsoever. I just did this experiment because I wanted to see the results for myself and I wanted to share them with you guys. So that's that. Okay, so let's start out with the Integra Boost. So this is the Integra Boost 67 gram two-way humidity control pack. And as you guys can see, I use the 72% relative humidity or RH for this experiment. Now, before I go any farther, there could be an argument about the 72% RH that I use in regards to cigars. That's not really what this video is about, so let's move on. Now, I placed 12 of those in my 250 count New Air humidor, which also has OptiTemp, so it controls the temperature in that humidor. I also used five of the eight gram packs just to help supplement that. Now, I also have an acrylic container that is airtight that holds about 36 cigars. I used one 67 gram pack in that container along with four eight gram packs. And I conducted this experiment over a span of three months. So in three months, here are the results I got from the Integra Boost Packs. Now in my 250 count humidor, the RH or relative humidity remained between 65 and 69 consistently. And in my smaller container, the RH only got to between 60 and 62. And during the experiment, I even threw more small packs in, they did no good to help. And the Boost Packs also come with a replacement indicator card and that will indicate when it is time to change your packs out. These indicators never changed. They always showed that the boost packs were good to go. So those were the results for the 72RH Integra Boost two-way humidity control pack. Now let's take a look at the Bovida. So this is the Bovida 72% RH two-way humidity pack. So this was pretty simple. At the end of the three months, I took all the boost packs out and replaced them with Bovida. So I used 12 60 gram Bovida packs in my 250 count humidor, along with five eight gram packs. And those were also 72% RH. And as you might've guessed in the smaller container, I did the same thing. So I pulled out all the boost, put in one 60 gram Bovida pack and four eight gram Bovida packs, all 72% RH of course. So after replacing the boost packs with the Bovida packs, within two days in both my 250 count humidor and the smaller 36 count container, the RH level had raised to 70. And over the three month time span, the RH level in the 250 count humidor remained between 67 and 70. And in the smaller humidor, the RH level remained between 69 and 70. So for my experiment, Bovida performed better regarding its advertised RH level. Boost didn't do a great job keeping the humidity that's promised on the pack. Obviously, you're gonna have some discrepancies there. Most manufacturers will say you'll have some play in between there where the humidity might not get to that level, which is understandable. Now, some quick things to consider. From a quick search on Amazon, Bovida's 12 pack for their 60 gram packs cost about $10 more than Integra Boost uh, 12 pack for their 67 gram packs. Now, 10 bucks might be a huge deal. I don't know. But when you're looking over the span of months where you're trying to maintain your cigars, 10 bucks doesn't seem like a huge additional investment to me. I'm gonna stick with Bovida. They've been consistent, and like I said, they outperformed the competition in my experiment. That's good enough for me at this point. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. As always, thanks for joining me. If you enjoyed this video, have enjoyed other videos, other reviews, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And until next time, be cool to each other, and I'll see you soon. Yeah, the news and the news and the company.